Good afternoon, I'm Brad Edwards. Right to breaking news, new hope in the fight against the coronavirus, encouraging new results about a drug being tested right here in Chicago. CBS2 investigator Megan Hickey has been following the testing for weeks. She's live outside Northwestern Memorial Hospital with what could be a game changer. Megan? Right, Brad, a, great, a game changer because COVID-19 could soon have an approved treatment. 34 participants in this landmark study were treated right here in Chicago. What it is proven is that a drug can block this virus. Dr. Anthony Fauci is talking about remdesivir, the antiviral drug involved in a worldwide study of about 75 testing sites. Two of them are here in Chicago, and we've been following the progress since the end of March. And it was almost exactly a month ago, and I know that you listed this as uh, one of the best case scenarios. It's definitely a game changer, and the, the reason it is a game changer is because now we have a treatment. Dr. Richard Novak is the principal investigator for the trial at UI Health, which had 15 patients enrolled. Dr. Bob Femi Taiwo is the lead investigator for the Northwestern Medicine Trial, where 19 coronavirus patients were part of the study. It is a glimmer of hope. It's, an, it's a very uh, exciting time, it's a promising time. And I think it's good news for, for our patients. Both researchers were part of an emergency call last night with study investigators. Today, the announcement that patients who received remdesivir had a 31% faster time to recovery than those who received the placebo. Remdesivir patients also saw a reduced mortality rate, 8% for the group receiving remdesivir versus 11 for the placebo. So I would say it's not a miracle drug. But it's certainly a very important drug and one that is much needed and would help a lot of people. If approved by the FDA for emergency use, it would be the first drug officially approved to treat COVID-19. And experts tell me it's certainly something to smile about. There's, there's reason to be to be happy today that we finally have something to to uh, to fight back with. So what are the next steps? The FDA needs to approve this drug for emergency use, which is expected after Dr. Fauci's comments earlier today. Although we do not have a timeline, the company that makes this drug, Gilead, has been ramping up production, but they will need to continue to do so to meet demand for this drug. Reporting live in Streeterville, Megan Hickey, CBS2 Investigators.